Hey, welcome to another question and answer session for MRCS examin. Which of the following statement relating to the gallbladder is untrue? So, for this area, we have to find out first of all gallbladder, then the details about the gallbladder, then it will be clear to us about the untrue option regarding the gallbladder. Here the options. Options are the fundus is usually intraperitoneal, arterial supply is from cystic artery. The cystic artery is usually located in the calot triangle. Calot triangle may be really contains an aberrant hepatic artery. Cholecystokinin causes a relaxation of the gallbladder. Now let's see the details of the gallbladder. So in the first picture, here we can see this is the liver and here two blood vessels here one is the inferior vena cava another is the abdominal aorta and in the lower part we can see the common bile duct and the it is the gallbladder so it is the uh, normal anatomical locations of the gallbladder relating to the liver and other uh, great vessels in the second picture we can see this is the gallbladder and here this is the cystic duct and it is common hepatic duct and we can see this is the liver and this triangle it is the calot triangle we can see the calot triangle inferiorly it is inferiorly and laterally it is by the cystic duct and on the right side or medially it is the common hepatic duct and superiorly liver so this triangle this is called the calot triangle and we can see the calot triangle it here, here is a artery and this artery is the cystic artery and this cystic artery it is branched from the right hepatic artery here we can see this is the right hepatic artery and here the left hepatic artery so branched from the right hepatic artery which is the cystic artery the cystic artery located into the calot triangle so the calot triangle contains the cystic artery and it is bounded superiorly by inferior surface of the liver on the right side or medially by the common hepatic duct and inferiorly or left side it is by the cystic duct so it is the normal boundary of the calot triangle and content of the calot triangle in this picture we can see the liver and gallbladder again and we can see this artery this is the cystic artery and this cystic artery is located within the calot triangle and here we can see some other structures such as this is the common bile duct and here the common hepatic duct in this picture we can see the circulation of the bile here and we can see the bile stored in the gallbladder then when contraction of the gallbladder occurs then bile release and we can see here is the hormone which is the cholecystokinin and it is released from the duodenal mucosa here from the duodenal mucosa cholecystokinin release and this cholecystokinin causes bile release for release of the bile there the gallbladder should be contracted so here contraction of the gallbladder occurs due to action of the cholecystokinin so this cholecystokinin it causes bile release from the gallbladder where the bile is stored on the other hand this cholecystokinin it goes to the pancreas and it causes pancreatic juice secretion so this is the function of the cholecystokinin on by on gallbladder to release by so here we can see this is the cck that means the cholecystokinin and the cck is released from the duodenal mucosa we can see it is released from the duodenal mucosa and one of the function is it causes the contraction of the gallbladder and with that will helps release of the bile from the gallbladder so our answer here the cholecystokinin it causes relaxation of the gallbladder it is not true because we saw that the cholecystokinin it is a hormone and it causes contraction it causes contraction of the 
gallbladder other option here we can see the fundus is usually intraperitoneal it is true arterial supply is from the cystic artery it is true the cystic artery is usually located in the calyx triangle it also true and really contain a brain artery that also true so our final answer which is not true relating to the gallbladder is the cholecystic ionin causes relaxation of the gallbladder the true answer will be the cholecystic ionin it causes a relaxation of the gallbladder thank you all